Hi guys, so I am back. It's getting a little hot up in here. <laughs> it's a little muggy out. Okay, so back to um, my area over here. You guys have to look at this salmon, um, eye sock salmon. It's so to die for. So I'm gonna give you a little peek abu. And then of course I'm gonna be doing my plating. But before I do all, do all that, do my plating and everything, I want to make sure that you see me uh, fry up those dippy eggs in a minute. So that's coming up in like three seconds. <laughs> and um, I want you to see how I do my plating um, as well. So I'm going to have to um, leave you there on my tripod and see if I can just get all this done on my stove, okay? All right, so um, instead of taking you off is what I'm saying. <laughs> Because I got some good thoughts I want to read to you as well. Um, my kiddos are still relaxing. <laughs> um, so look at that. Look at that fish. All those uh, diced minced garlic. Look at the fish. Look at the flavors. The color. As I said, the color was going to be very beautiful. With that spice. Sweet and spice sauce. From Baby Ray's, you gotta try it on some salmon fish to die for, really good. Um, so, and you have all those onions, potatoes, just dripping on top, so delicious, along with every other ingredient I stuck in there. So you have to follow my video in order to see how this happens, okay? <laughs> and I'm definitely gonna enjoy this as soon as I'm done and I'm done doing my plating, okay? So, um, I wanna show you, that's done nice and warm. I want to show you how I do my dippy eggs. All right, so we're going to get this flaming up. Okay, see me? Okay. And of course, I always, when I do dippy eggs, y'all, y'all, every time I do them, I do them again with low heat. If you put a plate on top or a lid or whatever you prefer to do, it will cook on itself very beautifully. Um, I know there's other things you can do as well, like those little pots that they have that make a perfect egg. I do that as well too, but um, this is how I'm doing it today. All right, so remember that butter, <laughs> that delicious butter that I uh, dipped into those um, lamb racks, okay? And see, all you needed was a little bit. So if you see, I still have all that butter from that lamb rock, okay? And I am going to put a teaspoon okay or i'm sorry a tablespoon okay let me just shake it up and you can see that butter and guess what i'm gonna do next i'm gonna fry that dippy egg with this butter so y'all thought i was gonna use that for a little bit more y'all thought i was gonna use that for the salmon no the salmon is good as is so like i said you want to go ahead and take those two eggs and two eggs, okay? And this gets hot quick because, again, it's that salted butter, okay? I always keep my eggs out because I use them a lot. So um, if you're an egg person like me, if you're an egg person like me, you will keep them out because when you cook them, they're a perfect temperature. So when you cook them, they're ready to, you know, cook up real good and you already have your plate, your breakfast, everything's already nice and done. Okay, I'm getting some love here on Instagram. I love you guys. Okay, don't make me cry. <laughs> I'm doing good here. All right, so, um, yeah, like I said, you want to leave the plates for, for at least count to like 20 and you're good. <laughs> All right. Then you want to remove the plates, okay? You want to learn how, to, how I cook my dippy eggs, especially when you do it with salted butter. You want to make sure that you're cooking it to perfection because that butter sticks a little bit. Just make sure that you uh, go around your egg. Make sure that it's cooking right. And it's not sticking to the pan very gently. Okay. And then again, you're going to throw that in there. And guess what? Turn it off. You're done. Two dip, dippy eggs completely done. So um, I definitely, I'm going to show you my plating in a little bit. 
Um, however, I want to make sure that this is working properly um, and that I can bring you down. However, I wanted to quickly, um, I wanted to quickly um, do the thought for the, the thought for today, <laughs> and I wanted to make sure I get that out to you guys as well. Um, I had like two cups of my yogi tea today, so I'm good with that. Um, it's humid out, so you know sometimes I save my tea for when it's cooler outside, and I definitely have my tea always in the morning. You guys already know that. All right, so I'm gonna get back to the ingredients, y'all. I'm gonna repeat them again for you guys to hear me out. So it's that Alaska sockeye salmon, okay? Very simple. Uh, let me just quick show you here because I actually kept a, uh, now wait, I kept a bag so you guys could see exactly what it is. So, and this cost about, I think about eight bucks for two big healthy pieces, which I think is pretty good. And um, this is the sockeye salmon Alaska uh, fillets that I used today. They come with the skin, so good. All right, and I got this at Wise, 150 calories, not bad. Um, like I said, I don't, I don't, uh, I try to cook healthy meals as long as, you know, I get my little Latin dishes in here and there, I'm good. <laughs> That's just me, okay? All right, so like I said, you're gonna do that one cup of water, you're gonna do the sweet baby ray, sweet uh, spicy barbecue sauce, one fourth of that, two tablespoons of the soy sauce. You're gonna dice a uh, half a big yellow onion in dices so it mixes in really good with the flavors and fish. A whole piece of uh, that carved uh, russet potato skin in dices, okay? Um, also, you know, you're gonna make sure, because like I said, that makes a great starch in the soy water, okay? So that's why I do them in dices, and that's why I use the skin to the potato. Okay, and then you're gonna add those two tablespoons of sofrito. Very simple. And that's pretty much it for the fish, for the salmon fish. I kept the ingredients really simple, and this is the dish that I love to chef up for you guys. I like to show off my food and show you what I can do. <laughs> So, um, and again, in the two dippy eggs, I used that butter, uh, that butter that I used the other day on the lamb rocks, super delicious to, to fry the eggs, to put it on top of my salad, super good, super delicious, can't wait. So, um, and just make sure you add a little bit of salt and pepper on top of the egg, on top of the fish, a little garnish, make it look pretty, and of course, it, for the taste of the salt as well. Okay, so that's it for that. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, um, shoot this out to you okay because like i said it does take long for these videos to download a bit and like i said add that salt and pepper a little salt because we already have great seasoning in the fish so you don't want to overdo it and there's your eggs everybody perfectly done Okay, and that's fried. That's a fried dippy egg. So, again, I'm going to get this on top of my salmon fish, and then we're going to read the thought of the day. So, I'll be right back. I'm going to shoot this guy, this uh, video to you guys. <laughs> okay, it's getting hot up in here. Okay, so I love you guys so very much. So, stay tuned for my last yum. Catch you in a bit. <laughs> 